Welcome to Project Eden for Imperium Galactic Survival. What I want to do in this video is carry on with the mission that we were working on in the last part, where we, we in the, well, in the last part, we actually raided the pirate base. We finally managed to find the, the recipe, which is here, the root beer formula. And what we're going to do now is take that to the distillery. But first things first, what I want to do is a little bit of work on my capital vessel before we leave just so that I can keep that moving forward and I keep an eye on what I need to do in order to get that finished. And what I'm currently doing at the moment is knocking out some uh, grow plots. I think I need 22 if I'm correctly. So it's just going to come in here. We got, yeah, we've got 22 now. I've also got the cockpit for the ship here as well. Before we leave, just want to check the power. Yeah, I've had a feeling the power supply was getting a bit low. I mean, we've got plenty of power, so we can dump some of these in. Just want to make sure the base stays powered so I don't lose the what's in the fridge there. So I don't really want to haul that all over the place. There's our good old capital vessel still hanging around and doing nothing because he's got no weapons. I'm just going to jump in here, put the thrusters on. Get out here. Hopefully it won't be long before we finally leave this planet. I've just about had enough of the, the cold, I think. Although, I think before we leave, I would like to have a little bit of a reckoning with the the Xerax on this planet. Looks like we've, I've taken another bit more damage as well. I'm just going to land on here. Land on the back here. Come in here. I'm just going to turn the shields and the thrusters off. I'm a little bit worried about that damage see what we what we damage we sustained go to repairs i'm sure i saw some damage along this side here sometimes it can be a little bit difficult to tell when you've got these we are so, so we obviously took a few hits on this side yeah but i don't think we took that much it took some hits on the front as well i mean the vertical protection grids here have, have been made it really worthwhile not seeing anything else no I must be we must have just taken some hits on this side is that damaged no okay good and I think what we will do is we'll just wander down in here of course, what I'm going to do is put in all the grow plots, but I think first things first, we're coming here. We're good player. Capital vessel, container controller. So we'll just get into here. Container controller, turn on that. Turn on this, turn on this. First things first, we're put our, our bridge on. I think we'll just go for a simple one at the moment. I mean, we may end up have, doing some intergalactic travel without actually all this enclosed. Depends on how well we go. Because the ship still can't really fly because it's got... Well, just to show you. We're a bit weak on the down thrusters. We've only got the two small thrusters at the back, so we need to make two of those. And the other thrusters that are actually missing is the forward-facing braking thrusters. I think once we've got those thrusters in, this, this ship should fly, in theory anyway. And what we're going to do is just come in here and we're just goes out. And we're just this area in. And what this will mean is that. I actually want to grow crops now. If I power up this uh, base, we will... Oh, shit, not base, what am I on about? We will have the option to actually grow some crops in here. So we'll start this side this time. Let's just go. Threes. One, two, three, four. 
So what that means is we've now got this area here. The only thing we're going to need is we've got another two grow lights, which is something I forgot completely about, but that's not a problem. As I say, we've now got the the bare essentials on here. We just need some more thrusters. But what I do definitely want to do in this video is get the finish off the beer. <laughs> do is get up into space now because one thing I do want to do is actually finish off this mission because a couple of you posted comments about the fact that even though I may have the recipe it's still I still may have a problem so I just want to find that and see so what I want to do is just get up and see if I can confirm that so let's just get up into space so here we are we've got to go and see Brutemaster Lark which is 19 kilometers away to just ping, send out a ping, see what's around. There's a Polaris freighter going by. There's nothing else really in the area. So I'll see you once I approach the um, the distillery. So here we are. We're just coming up on the top distillery, and what we got to do is find the landing pad. I think it's around on the right hand side here, where it says Brewmaster Lark. So we're just kind of curving some sun coming in there it is just there let me just orientate to the ship uh, not the ship the base so we'll get the impression I haven't repaired everything unfortunately a repair bay is a little bit far in the future thrusters off leave the shields on now comes the moment of truth we're just Put this down here. Um, get back through the don't think we can get over the top, so we are welcome back my friend. Did you have success? Give the recipe to Lark. Awesome. Please hand over the dist Awesome. Please head over to the distillery main building and check my collar brewmaster at your thick. He will initiate the brewing, brewing process. Oh, ha, thank you, game. <laughs> I think there is a med bay here so we can heal up. Yeah, so I'm just going to go over here. Of course, we can't loot these boxes, which is a bit unfortunate. I think they're all kind of restricted. So we're just going to go over to talk to the brewmaster. The brewmaster. It's actually a name for the old buses in London. Though the spelling is different actually, come to think of it. Just have a quick once round here. I think everything off here, down here is off limits. Another med station. Yeah, everything down here is off limits as well. Well, it's worth a try. Just go up. Whoops, go up. You are you late. You are late. <laughs> Whatever, Terran. The whole universal universe of taste is in peril. You must hurry now. This is no worries, Terran. Despite your questionable delay, I will be able to meet the schedule. There is a recreation area in the office on the other side of the building. So, so thank you for your understanding. But please not stand in my way any longer. Thank you. <laughs> You're a very sociable guy, aren't you? No, we'll just have a quick look round just in case. No, we have to. We won't jump off the top this time. We're actually used the proper way down. We're going through a lot of food actually. Let's see, we should still be in range of. Uh, see, we're up, we have some cereal. Uh, Two hundred ninety-eight. I think I've just messed that up, but we got a great big pile of grilled steaks. So. Just top that up. And we're go all the way across. When the attack comes, this is where it's gonna happen. What you can do is fight your way out kind of using these containers for cover, but it's quite hard work. So you're far better to actually destroy the opposition in the ship. You would expect to get at least some refreshments in the distillery, right? Um, 
I suppose what we do now is just hang around. This is Brewmaster Lyric speaking. Battle stations. We've been sabotaged. Sabotage, I tell you. Defense turrets are shut down and we are tracking enemy signals coming in from all sides. For everyone with weapons, defend the station. Yes. Well, we're going to help you, but we're not going to do it on foot. Very involved process. We're going to do it with the ship. This one gives us the aerial superiority. <laughs> Buster's on. I think this should trigger them. There they are. Hello, guys. Pull back. Somebody's shooting at me with a shotgun, actually. Okay. <laughs> There's the shotgun guy, down the bottom there. Seven. Hello. We could get in and do a bit of a quick high speed looting, but it'd be a bit risky. I'm a little bit tempted. You. Oops. Ah. Hello, guys. Armored Golem there. Wow, okay. Um, okay, I can do it. That explains to you what I mean by that. That should be it. Let's get in and do some looting. Certainly wouldn't mind those Armored Golems. That's certainly a little bit beefed up from last time. Where's the other one? There you are. I'll just get you. You. I think most of these bodies from the first wave have been gone now, haven't they? Oh, there's one. Oh, he's just gone. That's a bit, a bit unfortunate. I think that is about it. So, just land. Turn the jetpack off. 
and where's what we got here we'll just do a bit of an unload put this in the fridge and container controller Just go and see our friend. So we just go and see Brewmaster Lark. I mean, that was pretty good, actually. Quite enjoyed that. I mean, doing that on foot can be a real pain. As I say, you, what you've got to have to do is all oh, fly across. Yeah, you, you've really got to do the maneuvering. Formidable. How can we ever repay you for your extraordinary service? Promise fruit beer. Oh, I know. Ticket for the anniversary party. It was sold out months ago. Thanks. Uh, please head to the Inferno Club. Check for the club manager's slick. Root beer delivery has been dispatched by the shuttle, so nothing remains for you to do but get the promising gratification. Okay, it's been a pleasure. Wonderful. Have a great time. <laughs> the second time I've done that. Um, well, uh, but we can heal up from there. So what we've got to do now is head back to the Inferno Club. Let's jump in here. Busters are still on. And we're just going to head back off to the Inferno Club. And just, I'll just do a full reload. Just ping out anything around here. We've got the hidden station there, 6.8 kilometres away. I don't think there's anything left there unless I put just want to pick up some copper. But uh, let's just have a look on the loading of the ship. So we got a few things there. I wouldn't mind actually possibly going to the trading station. And oh, we've got 22 carbon composite in here as well, which is a, a bit of an issue. What I'm going to do now is just head for the Inferno Club and I'll see you once we get there. Okay, welcome back. As we were travelling towards the Inferno Club, we actually came a lot pretty close to the orbital trading station. So I think it makes sense to drop in and see if we can sell some stuff off. Also, somebody posted a comment to say that I actually missed a, a quite a significant trader. So uh, I'm just going to turn the thrusters off, turn the lights off as well. Don't actually need them at the moment. And just go in here and cross by fly in across here, just go up. And we'll just have a little bit of a walk around. I think most of the items of interest are actually one level up, aren't they? Mm don't need any crops what we're after really is the mining talk we're certainly going to talk to this guy so we just let's show you what you've got to offer anything here we're certainly going to take the magnesium powder as usual I don't so we've got some neodymium as well we'll take that because I might need it for I mean, it's not expensive, it's just finding it. I think the rest of the stuff were okay. Uh, I don't think I've got any drills. Let me just take a quick look. Have I got any cheap drills? Have we got a cut one? How damaged is this drill? We got, got two drills. So if I put that in there, what I could do is sell this drill and then put this back onto my toolbar. I think that'll work, so we'll just get rid of the drills. Drills, we'll sell two of those. 956. Oops, I think don't do that. Just put this drill off of this toolbar. What else have we got? We've got some tier two multi tools as well. Let's go a, a little bit of a walk around here. I don't think there's anything, any guys here. I think most of the other stuff is up here, isn't it? So we've got the Sky Guys bar. Oh. 
what we've got up here. What have we got up here? Restricted. Uh, show me what you offer. Uh, narcotics and toxic waste. There's a technical artifact there. No, I've got. I'm sure I've got. Oh, I didn't bring it with me. That's the point. Got the beer. Oh, I've got another drill here. I've got number two drills here, actually. <laughs> okay. Right, this is the Inferno Club. Got our friend over there. We can. Maybe what you want to offer. <laughs> medium armor, energy matrix. Let's certainly take the medium. Oh, we've got magnesium. Oh, nitrocellulose. Large, large optronics bridge. We don't really have enough for that. EPA boost. We've got some night vision goggles. I can't remember for how many have I got, so let me just take a look. He's making a lot of funny noise. Got the night vision goggles. Have I lost my night vision goggles? Okay, well, we need to keep one set just in case so we can sell one of those. Oh, we've got some tier 2 multi tools. Got one. We got three tier two, including the one that I've got mount on my ship. Spare one here. So we could sell three tier two multi tools as well. So we can sell three of those. Which we didn't. So that can be another 5,000. That'd be quite nice. And we can sell the night vision goggles. Let's give me a little bit extra cash. You can get up down to there and quick second check again just to make sure. Biofuel, I'll drop the bridge. Nope. Guy over here. And show me what you've got to offer. You're just straight up. Optronics bridges. Let's check the bar. Hello, guys. What are you, you on guard against something? Of course, this is the trader. I think all he sells is food, isn't it? Oh, platinum bars. Right, so let's just work our way back down here. We've spoken to you, but you're gonna buy. You could buy some more multi tools, couldn't you? We just oops. Yeah, what we got here? Drills, isn't it? So we could sell. Yeah, because we're gonna get. Once we finish the main mission, we're gonna get an epic drill, so we can. Sell off a couple more drills. Uh, as they say, don't count your chickens before they're hatched. And we just have a bit of a walk around here and see what we can find. Anybody over here? Anything off the room here. These guys are just so spooky. <laughs> All right, spaceman. Have a seat.
Here's the conference room where we should get the dodgy trader. See what we got to offer. Yeah. So we got tier two rocket launcher, tier two laser pistol. Okay, let's see what we can sell off here. I've certainly got a tier two laser pistol. Oh, so let's just, let's just shove everything in here. Uh, let me see, pulse rifle, shotgun, shotgun, although be careful that we don't sell off the it too. I don't think he's interested in anything like that. Uh, we've got tier 2 projectile pistol, another tier 2 projectile pistol. I don't, I don't normally use pistols, so uh, oh, we've got another tier 2 multi-tool. We're going to keep the multi-tool. I like at least one backup and I certainly would like to keep a backup laser rifle as well. Tier 2 projectile pistol. How many of those have we got? Two of those we can sell off. Get rid of those. Pulse rifle. Um, how, many, how many of those have we got? We've got tier 2 pulse rifle. He's not interested. He's only interested in tier 1 pulse rifles. We've got two of those. Sell off two of those. And of course he's got quite a lot of other stuff. Oh, we've got some heavy up weapons upgrade kits and stuff like that we can sell off as well. What we've got here? Pulse, another pulse rifle, another pulse rifle. Which I didn't count. Just sell off those. Got a uh, projectile pistol. Sell off another one of those. Uh, pulse rifle tier two. I've got a laser pistol. Again, I don't really use the laser pistols, so we'll sell off that. But what we're we getting down to now. Not got shotgun tier two here. That one's damaged, so if I, <laughs> I don't trust you again. So we'll just put that back there, and we're, we're selling the damage here to shotgun, which is this one. Good. We've got a minigun. Again, I don't really like miniguns, so I sell the minigun. I've rifle tier two. He's not really interested in those, so uh, just put that back. Uh, tier two shotgun there. Pick up the upgrade kits. Well, let's see how many of these we can sell. Shotgun, laser, pistol. I mean, we've got the epic, what we call it there. Actually, you've got, uh, you've got them in there. Yeah, I'm quite happy with that. So, uh, just see what he will buy in the way of upgrade kits. So he's got a shotgun upgrade kit. We should be able to sell about five of those. Get rid of those. Rifle upgrade kit. Got two of those. Um, heavy weapons upgrade kit. Got one of those. Sniper rifle up kit. All that as well. What we got here? Laser pistol upgrade kit. We've got six of those. Wow. That's going to be quite nicely. And we've got a pistol upgrade kit. Okay. So, that's not a bad haul, actually. Um, take the magnesium powder. Flamethrower fuel. Mm. If so, not particularly that interested. The armor. 105,000. Well. Well, we got to 59,000, so that's, that's not bad. And what we can do now is just... Okay. A, B, 
the can go down any of these so put it down here yeah just right next to the ship jump back into the ship this is on looking for the Inferno Club which is just over there only problem is we've got to kind of fly around these defense um, capabilities so we just go this way a little bit and I'll see you once we get to the Inferno Club assuming that I don't fall foul of any of these Xerox bases tucked here so here we are we're just coming up on the Inferno Club and we just need to find somewhere to land Again, more like Space Inferno Club or something. Speak to the manager. Yes, I'm not sure what our orientation is at the moment. I think coming in on a pretty good one actually. Uh, we need to go this way, I think, to be able to land. I think I've just hooked the front of the ship onto there, so take you out there. I think if we go directly up onto up onto the roof, we can get straight to the manager if I'm correctly. We're gonna just oh this might there we are. We don't you know the uh, Inferno Club welcomes all desires. I'm club manager slick. I've been messaged by Brewmaster Yilk about the engagement in the most recent release. Please make yourself comfortable. Your suit will be upgraded to VIP. So, um, your suite will be upgraded to VIP status and you've already best been added. Ask your venerable crew to attend as well, my crew. Ah, never mind. Do enjoy your stay. We'll do my best. So what we've got to do now is go and speak to the bartender. Which means we'll have to go back down through the building. I think it's the bartender that gives us the epic draw. I think um, one of these are the bathrooms. <laughs> uh, I think this is the way out. Yes. Uh, life form is said. It said your crew. Yep. I didn't know I had a crew. So we'll just go talk to the bartender. Whoops. Hey. Like I told you the last squid here, oh no cred, ah this you, please excuse my harsh words but I've had some trouble lately. So here you are, one anniversary best selling root beer made possible thanks to efforts as I've heard from my colleagues at the distillery, usual day at work. Sounds like everyday mission is there by crew. Oh sorry, I just noticed the insignia on your collar, been a while though. Details please, let me think, uh, it happened a few months ago, a few strangers with uniforms like yours came into the club and ran into some and to some of the also drunken Xerox troopers, the Xerox Empire, Scout of Andromeda, yep. And your people came in asking for something and noticed the Xerox and then things got crazy, ha ha. They have beaten those Xerox out of the club, literally. We've had to redecorate the main hall, but hey, what a show. Now that we have our own security personnel here, bad for some customers, but hey, anything else maybe, hmm, not much I'm afraid. One of yours is was called um was something like with our our Alf Axel, not to be sure to be honest. Alex. Yes, that's the name. Wait. They talked about a remote planet and a ship waiting somewhere for someone. Ah. Before I forget about this, one of them left behind a specially modified drill. I have it at my desk. I have no use for it, so you might as well have it. Yes, thank you. Great to hear. En enjoy the root beer, my friend. Cheers the music and disco so what we should now have is oops hello my friend Kessel where, where are you speaking from seems that there's a party going on I enjoy but do not rest too long I have a word from my organization due to your excellent performance in this mission help and top regain the beer recipe they've chosen to give me you more info on the matter of the operation of Phoenix glad to hear but the mission felt like a test being set up for me ah gotcha but well, I hope you won't mind bear with us 
we need to make sure that one the one we trust is not an imposter and up to the challenge the organization may throw at him anyway in case you may want to know more about the operation of phoenix go to the slow planet in this system therefore you will find a wreckage of the uch titan it was shot down in the battle and follow the arrival of the operation phoenix fleet yet yeah, another test well i think we are on the snow planet aren't we um receive uh, uh recover a few look Bunny wants to recover a few logs that have been lost in the wreckage they seem to be extremely important to their nexus codes to the console okay when you're going to the snow planet you need at least a small vessel with a warp drive but I better add some weapons and turrets for the Xerox have quite a presence on this icy rock. You're not allowed anyone to come close to the wreckage. Okay. Um, Crash bird, approach the workshop. I have absolutely no idea what that is. Okay, let's just get out the front door. Hello, guys. So we've got the next step in the mission. Of course, we've got the... Got a steel of credibility for the Polaris Mega Corp. That could be useful. I thought I'd get an epic drill. Oh, yeah, we've got the epic drill down here. Keep forgetting it puts it on the toolbar. And I think this would probably be a good point to stop because we're obviously at the beginning of another mission. And one of the confusing things is, is, is the snow planet they're referring to, the snow planet that I'm on, or is there another snow planet in this system which is going to be quite interesting but before we do that if i open up the map here we are very close to ningus moon here so i think in the next part rather than going back to the uh, um, ningus itself i think we'll pop up to the moon to see if i can get some more thrusters but that's going to be for the next part so until next time whatever you do enjoy your gaming